All right, guys, so today's job, removing these overgrown Trachycarpus fortuniae. So I've been power washing the roots to expose them somewhat. <clears throat> but these trees are ginormous. I don't think they can be removed alive. The owner wants them removed alive. Look at all the babies. <laughs> but um, I don't know that they can be. I couldn't expose too much roots on this one. That thing is in there. But it's so close to the house that to get like a skid steer with a shovel and stab it down in there, I, I, this, I'm worried I'm going to hit foundation or the stuckling of the house. Look how big it is. It's going into the gutter. Massive tree. And it's got this wicked lean on it. So, we're gonna attempt to take out one of them, this one over here. We're gonna make the attempt. I'm gonna power wash, expose all the roots. Get a little trench going around it. I might have to get a skid steer in here and try to get up under it. Basically, just have to pop the tap root and then pull it back. But it's so big and heavy. He's got a lot. He's got this one. They're all just too close to the house. Whoever planted them planted them right on top of the house. Like. I mean, you can see, I don't have the biggest of hands, but it's like two hand lengths away from the house. Who would plant that there? This one has a giant crown. Too close to the house. And this one is just the closest of them all. <laughs> what do you guys think? Can these be removed? Look how close this one is. <laughs> like finger length I mean a hand length away from the house what do you guys think what tools are going to be needed to get this out of the ground alive and they'd like to maybe move them over here put them out here in the sun where they should have been put the first time so what do you guys think what tools a mini skid steer for sure, probably a full-size skid steer if you ask me, with a big old shovel. All right, 1400 PSI. Try to expose those roots. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, this is a huge tree. 